And with all the sports, of course, comes certain injury risks like injuries to the head or concussions. So here today is to talk more about this is Dr. Stephanie Alessi LaRosa, the director of Hartford HealthCare's Sports Neurology Program. And Dr. Alessi, I know we know each other, so thank you for being here. We can share the information about concussions since my kids have already had to come to you a couple of times. Yes, yes. <laughs> Happy to be here. Yeah, so how common are concussions and what are the most likely causes usually? Uh, concussions can happen with athletic and non-athletic reasons. Um, really accidents such as falls or uh, work-related, motor vehicle-related, as well as sports-related are the main causes. So let's talk about the symptoms. Uh, it's always confusing, I know, right after. What should you be looking out for after a head injury? Head injury symptoms can be wide ranging. So uh, really things like headaches, dizziness, balance issues, mood changes, or sleep problems, uh, among others, are the main symptoms. And, you know, recovery really um, is important. And, and the, neck, the neck muscle strain is something that goes often un, um, undiagnosed and overlooked. Um, and obviously the neck is in close proximity to the head. So uh, this is something that can prolong recovery that I always look out for. Yeah, you might need some physical therapy or something. So how do you typically determine if someone actually has a concussion? Yeah, concussion uh, is a clinical diagnosis, and it's um, really uh, not every hit to the head is a concussion. So I perform a thorough history as well as a neurologic examination in the office, and I, I ask specifically for details about the mechanism of the injury as well as the symptom course. And what do you recommend for recovery and protecting from any further head trauma? Recovery should be focused on the symptom management and, um, you know, a close follow-up so that uh, the injury itself can change every day. So close follow-up is very important. And to protect against a serious injury and further trauma from a head injury, I recommend immediate removal from play if any athlete has a standout hit or if they complain of any concussion symptom. All right, Dr. Alessi, thank you. And I know you need an expert like yourself to make sure you know you're getting the good treatment. So we appreciate your expertise today. Thank you so much. Thank you. And for more information, you can visit hartfordhealthcare.org slash neuro. You could go see Dr. Alessi yourself if you need to.